I'm on my way to race one of Cade's old buddies from school in his little F-150. Hopefully they don't beat my tube up too bad. I ain't got the nitrous on it. I probably need the nitrous on it. But we're gonna find out. Y'all ride with us for a minute. This should be pretty entertaining. I told you don't beat up over too bad. So we'll see. So you'll give me the hit. So eight balls right where about where that tree line is. Ready? The tree line. You'll say ready, set, go. All right, guys, welcome back to the truck. <laughs> welcome back to the channel. I'm out here at Shady Side today. I'm helping out with this car. He, he asked me if he could come down from Tennessee or whatever and I could help him out. So I was like, you know what? I don't know if we're going to share times or nothing, but it's a pretty, pretty nice car we got right here. And uh, he said that, you know, they don't really get. Don't be that guy. He said that he don't really, uh, Bristol, they don't really get to race a lot. The track prep ain't really there. So he wanted me to help you out with the suspension and see what it can do. It's a small block Ford car. So we're gonna go in, I'm gonna show you what I see wrong first thing. You'll see the upper control arm, how high it is. Yeah. So always remember that the that, that suspension can never lift higher. And as I jacked the car up where I want it to be separated at, which is about three inches, and we're already going uphill. So we're gonna take this control arm because where I got it jacked up at, we're gonna take that control and we're gonna drop it down in the front and level it out. And that way we'll have our full range of power because the way it was set up, that was already almost level. So it, there's no way the car could have separated because it does not have no power over these back tires. So we're gonna go through and take this chassis side. We're gonna loosen it up. We're gonna drop those down and that'll give us some more anti-squad in it. And we'll go from there. He already has his lowers in a good spot from what I can tell by eye. But we just gotta get these uppers so we get this rear suspension where we want it. And then we're gonna go around the car. I've already took his rear shocks. I took his rebound and put them at about four. I've done his compression about 12. And that way we can come in here and once we get this, we'll, we'll go send the car down the track and see how it does right here in just a minute. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a medicine. Kind of. It is, yeah. It's got, it's but got. It's but not, it's, it's not, it's not bad. bad no, it's like a, it's more like a Sprite or a Mountain Dew. Yeah. Kind of. But it has like a medicine. All right, guys. Well, got a rear suspension adjusted. Got the shocks adjusted where I think. Front suspension adjusted. Set two step, boost everything. So let's see if we get a good first pass out of it. And let's work off of that. Let's see what we can do with you.
right, guys. So here's what we're looking at. Show y'all what I'm looking at. Okay, so the car here, it left at 3,800 and nine pounds of boost. He pedals it within a four tenths. It made, it only made nine pounds there. It goes down, he gets back in it, gets out of it, gets back in it. You wouldn't believe that thing's a 125 mile hour pass right there, would you? Yeah. Doing all that. that. No, and only no, making that much boost. Yeah. Look at it. This whole thing's gonna fly. Eight, nine pounds of boost. Oh, this thing's gonna be fast. Right. We're gonna give him a little bit more this time. Yeah. That's done. The sheets and trout and see if we can't get some M1 out of one of these old gas pumps over here. Man, that pump methanol is getting expensive. Look at that stuff right there. 319. I'm gonna pay like a dollar seventy-nine for it. That's highway robbery right there. What y'all think, Kate? You think that, that pump methanol is uh it it's going up on us, ain't it? Three dollars and nineteen cent versus a dollar seventy nine when I paid a couple years ago. That's that's a little rough, ain't it? Make sure you help me out with that methanol there, David. I will. You gotta help me out right here. We'll be all right. We'll be there, good. You, there you go. Take that methanol. Look at that methanol. Man, I can't believe you're at Reg85. That, that blows my mind. She shit me. Well, it's 745 at night. We're leaving Mooresville. They couldn't get the track dry enough, even though it's beautiful outside right now. And I think we could have run enough cars across it. We could have got some heat down there, but they, they didn't feel safe with it. It's their track, their insurance, their deal. So I understand. So. It is what it is. So last night it rained, tonight it rains. I hate the rain. It is what it is, but we need the rain.